Hey, sisters, come on in. Y'all see what the day is, the movie is about. Come on, y'all. Come on in, bring your Kool-Aid, your cocktail, your water. Bring your food and snacks and sit and chat with who? Me, that hood girl to the hood, y'all. The movie today is Tuesday Tacos. This is scene one, take one. Let's roll the tape. Uh-oh, we did that wrong. <laughs> Let's roll the tape. Come on in, y'all. This is the day before all the cooking begins. Some people have started cooking like yesterday, making pies. My mom did. Look at y'all. We got a Taco Bell. Uh, let's say prayers. Father God, thank you for this another day. Thank you for mercy, grace, and tender love, Father. Have your way in each and every one of our lives. Let this food be nourishment to my beautiful and healthy body. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen and amen. All right, y'all. Without ado, I'm hungry. And uh, my sister was on the phone. I'm like, I, I'm, I'm getting ready to record. Look here, y'all. Uh, this is for a good week. And, uh, yeah. Uh, bless the hands that's going to be cooking all that good stuff. So this is for all my hustlers. Hey, y'all. Cheers. Salute. Salute. Let's sip, sip this Mountain Dew. Y'all, without ado. Here you go. Take what you want because I'm about to put some jalapeno peppers on here. Mm-hmm. My own. Because you know the regular nachos by granny don't come with the jalapenos. But I have a taco right here. So I want some uh, jalapenos on mine. Y'all, I'll tell you something. I took out. I, I did. Uh, yesterday I uh, cooked my cornbread so it can dry out a little bit before I make my dressing with it. I took out today my uh, me stuff for about for my um, dirty rice and the gizzards and stuff that's supposed to be in my cornbread dressing. And I took out my uh, I took out my um, Cornish hens, y'all, so I can get them babies uh, stuffed with good old garlic butter and all that other good stuff. Oh yeah. I am so ready to cook. I'm going to make some homemade potato salad and uh, some green beans with some white potatoes in it. I'm telling y'all, that hood girl love to cook, especially for Thanksgiving. Mm-hmm. So, y'all, yeah, I'm so ready. I put on some sour cream up right here as well, but mm, it's just me. I heard on the news today that, uh, I'll put that right there, that uh, so many people are depressed uh, on these holidays, and I understand that. Uh, I do not get depressed uh, on the holidays, uh, y'all, because, uh, you know, I'm not, we're not going to have a group of people. My mama said no, and I really don't blame her, because, um, you know, you don't know where our children been and who they been with, and you don't know all that stuff, so it's just going to be me once again, and my Dave and them be doing some stuff. I don't know what my middle son going to be doing. Y'all, I told them, don't give me no beans. Give me a double portion of meat, and I still don't see the meat, y'all. I don't know what the hell they did. Mm, I wanted to. Mm. I tell my good friend Dion, I'm going to get me some tacos. Now, I could have went to that uh, taco wheel for the street tacos, but y'all know that ain't enough food for me. And they don't have rice and beans. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Y'all. Here you go. I was looking at Aunt C today. Her nachos look real good. Mm-hmm. Mm. Y'all mm. had a good week. Well, a good couple of days. I'm off until Monday. 
I don't have no plans. But the plans are in my head. I'm just cooking tomorrow. Or be preparing. And it's out. I don't know what the other day is going to bring. But. If it's God's will. I will be Netflixing. Sipping a cocktail. And doing me. But I'm praying. For those who are depressed, because you know a lot of people lost mothers and fathers and children. Mm hmm. And, um, uh, so, if y'all think about someone who have lost somebody, pray for them. And Lynn, you know, I got you. Kicking it with Lynn. Taking the was doing a, <laughs> she's so funny. And I really want to be on that panel. She didn't know how to add a guest on uh, StreamYard, y'all. And I was trying to help her, but she couldn't do it, y'all. We're going to have to teach her then how to do that. Because um, she was drinking my kind of drink, y'all. I was going to pour it up. I'm gonna, I was going to pour it up. Mm-hmm. Mmm. I'm eating too bad. Mmm. This is good. I probably need some more uh, chips. Y'all, it's messy. Anyway, on the news, they have a number that you can call. But it was like people who were depressed with COVID, you know, about COVID and missing their family. So, don't, uh, don't be uh, lonely. Call out to somebody. There's somebody out there that can help you. Mm-hmm. I know we all have some low days. Mm-hmm. Lonely days. All of us. Just got to reach out for help. Don't be so prideful, you know. Every guy, everybody needs some help at some moment. In their lives. Yeah. I'm eating fast. Because I'm getting full. And this is good and it's messy. My mama sent me a picture yesterday, y'all. Um, with a sweet potato pie. And I'm thinking, I, who want to eat all them pies? I can't eat them all. It's only going to be me. <laughs> mm hmm Well, she have a neighbor that she feeds. And then he supply her with being serious. <laughs> what an exchange, huh? Mm hmm So I asked her, I say, do you feed his girlfriend? She say, hell no, she don't do nothing for me. <laughs> if I was a woman, I mean, if I was a woman, if I was somebody's girlfriend, and some other woman was feeding my man, hmm, it won't happen. Would y'all allow that? Comment below. I wouldn't. No other woman would be feeding my man. Because first thing I would think. 
especially if she's a good cook. You know, they say I wait a man's heart is through his stomach. And if she cooking good and she feed him every day, y'all already know, huh? I would think there's something, something going on. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to investigate. Y'all, I'm telling y'all, I told them double meat. Ain't no meat on here. They ain't give me no double meat. I need to be uh, uh, cooking over there. Picking the people food. Mm. Ain't no double meat. It really isn't. Ain't no double meat. It's like I'm looking for meat. And I paid for the double meat. You know what? They gave me a spoon. Mm -hmm. So would y'all let y'all man eat another woman's food every day? And she knock on the door and you in there and she still pass your man her food. <laughs> or vice versa. Uh, for a man. Would you allow another man to feed your girl? Every day? Mm-hmm. And you know. But I asked my mama. I said, Mama, so how do you think that Man, she said, what, well, nigga? Even when I go knock on his door and ask him to go to the store for me, and she there, they both get up and go. Mm. 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 -hmm. I don't know, y'all. But, from what I hear, that old dude, uh, done, done had quite a few of the women over there in that 55 year old community. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh. I didn't eat that taco. Y'all, this is messy and good. But they put quite a few tomatoes on here. We run out of time. Mm. Y'all. I'm not doing nothing tonight. What am for? I'm going to take a bath, put on me some of my cute little lounging clothes, and kick back. What's today, Tuesday? I don't even know what come on on Tuesday. I don't really watch TV like that, y'all. Maybe I'll do something on Netflix. I don't know. Mm, tastes like a bean right there. Y'all know everybody don't like Taco Bell. Ooh. I like it for a quick fix. Mm. This was good though. I don't know if I like that cheese. I'm gonna make my own, you know, my meatless like 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 we did for Jazzy V. Mm-hmm. My meatless tacos was delicious. Oh y'all. Mmm. I'm full. How many minutes we got? One. Hmm. <laughs> we look at y'all. 
I know y'all dinner gonna be good. I don't know how many of y'all are gonna have a full family. Please be safe. I don't I just want y'all to be safe. I need to see y'all again. Okay. Thank you, my my husband's new and old. But you know what I think um uh, is happening on YouTube, y'all. People uh subscribe and and you see, you see, you see your number go up and you see when they do it. And then you subscribe back to them. And then the next day you have lost a subscriber. I believe that the game now is when people who want the, the, the subscriber count, they subscribe to people. And then once they subscribe to you, they'll go back and unsubscribe to you. That's bull crap, and that's wrong. That is really wrong. I see it every day, and I know y'all see it too. I believe people think they clever, but you can't fool a player, okay? I know y'all subscribe, and then go back and unsubscribe once they subscribe to y'all so y'all can have y'all numbers. I wish I knew who y'all were, because I would do the same thing to y'all. I would unsubscribe right back to y'all. Mm-hmm. That ain't right. Ain't nothing right about that. But you know what? When you do people wrong, it does come back to you. So when you start to unravel, you think back to what you did. Uh-huh. That's bull crap. So look here, y'all. I just had to get that out because it was on my mind all day. So y'all ready to sing yourself out? Let's get ready. <clears throat> it's time to say goodbye for now. We have another chance around on the other side. So whatever you do for the rest of this evening, do it good, do it with purpose, and do it with what? Genuine love. I love y'all. See you next time.